We've got a special, maybe even awkward moment with Jason Priestley in today's Entertainment City. But first, a show stealing spill for Madonna at the Brit Awards. Watch the horror unfold during Madonna's first Brit Awards performance in 20 years as she wipes out, crashing down a flight of steps while performing Living for Love. But like the queen of pop she is, Madge got right back up and carried on. Upon closer inspection, it looks like one of the star's backup dancers was attempting to pull off her cape. And indeed, Madonna revealed her cape was, quote, tied too tight in an Instagram post after the fall. The 56-year-old also assured fans she was all right, writing, nothing can stop me and love really lifted me up. Another big moment, Kanye West getting fired up while performing his new song, All Day, featuring flamethrowers and lyrics so full of expletives, most of the performance was muted. Oh. Mother Monster is coming to American Horror Story. Lady Gaga revealed the news on Twitter with this video. She'll be a series regular on the fifth season of the hit FX series in her first ever major TV gig. Gaga also revealed the title of the new season is Hotel. Canada's brightest stars were shining last night at an early gala for the Canadian Screen Awards. Sunday night's a huge night for you. I know. You're nominated for Best Actress. You're up for one of the biggest awards that the CSAs has to offer. No pressure. Yeah, don't I make just me, realized. Made me really nervous all of a sudden. It's so wonderful to get such a high recognition for a job that you love. Last time we saw you, you guys were just promoing uh, Young Drunk Punk. It yeah. hadn't come out yet. Now it's out. What's it like actually seeing all that work that went into place now on screen? It's awesome. I'm so proud of everybody who was involved and it's funny like it makes me laugh it's come together and it's adorable to watch speaking of adorable or maybe awkward there was some John Travolta style bromance happening on the red carpet you're so wickedly talented oh, and I just, oh, I just love oh, every time thanks. I see you oh thanks okay. <laughs> <Not> the hair <laughs> coming up on Monday we'll have all the highlights from the red carpet at Sunday's Canadian Screen Awards when we'll be catching up with the stars in the Entertainment City Hello Canada Lounge the ceremony will be hosted by funny lady Andrea Martin, while Julianne Moore, who just nabbed an Oscar for Best Actress, will be a presenter. Moore is also a CSA nominee for her leading role in David Cronenberg's Maps to the Stars. A romantic crime caper hits theaters tomorrow, and our Melanie Ng sat down with Adrian Martinez to talk focus. You hitting that? I'm right here. Love your character. Oh, great. Because he's so fun. So he's like the guy that can just say whatever he wants. He doesn't have a conscience. How was working with Will? He's a larger than life person, you know. Like I just I was like I felt like an old guy just with a Geiger counter on the beach looking for change. And then I just found like this pot of gold and that's Will Smith. How is Buenos Aires? It's a great place. Have you been? I haven't. Let's and go. Let's just let's just leave right now. Yeah. Let's go. Let's get out of the cold. Coming up tomorrow, BT Vancouver store Die Cow sits down with Focus's leading lady, Margot Robbie. Happy anniversary. Me and you, just us two. Who doesn't love Mr. Big? Any excuse we can get to sit down with Chris Noth, we will. We really got some, um, some good insight as to what kind of a dad he is, as well as a, a husband. And his wife is Canadian, and uh, he, he has a big affinity uh, with Canada. But of course, what we all wanted to know was, is there going to be a Sex and the City reunion? Hey, he's up for it. That's all he's saying right now. Mr. Big is in. We'll just have to see if, uh, if the guy Check out the issue on newsstands and your next issue app now. I'm going to think. Entertainment headlines on Twitter at NCity.